Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Beer Bros. This week, it's Oktoberfest. But it's September. So for our first beer of the week, coming from Shiner, we have Oktoberfest. Not good with talking. Hmm? Not, I guess <laughs> lack of coordination with what exactly I'm supposed to so, do. So yeah. So normally you'll uh, open the beers. Oh, okay. And then pour us one. Okay. This is Shiner Oktoberfest. It is at 5.7% ABV uh, Shiner beer. And in my experience, Shiner, every beer that Shiner makes tastes like a Shiner beer. However, <laughs> they've getting more, been getting more crafty with their beers lately. And if you wanted to jump in and add anything, yeah. no? Okay. Well, Manny's shy. <laughs> I don't know if I'd agree that Shiner beers all taste the same. I think they have a little bit of variance, but definitely excited to try this Oktoberfest flavor. Okay. Well, first we're going to look at it. And it's got a little quarter finger of head. It's got a caramel color with a smattering of effervescence. That's one of our favorite words, effervescence. Effervescence? Yes. I didn't think I learned that word. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do so well in the SATs. And so, you know, mm. We won't go there. <laughs> so then we'll take a sniff. We get scolded sometimes because I put my hand over the thing to... Yeah. <laughs> and this doesn't have as strong as a Marzen scent as a, I would be accustomed to. It's, there's a little something there. A little sweetness, a slight maltiness, but not as much as I would get with typical Marzens. Yeah. That was a bit fruity. Kind so, of. Yeah. And this is the part where we go clinky drinky. Some people say frost. <laughs> it's a little weaker. It's not a lot of flavor in it, you know? I feel like the, the hoppiness is a bit there, but mm -hmm. it doesn't have any aftertaste that right. you usually see with a lot of Morrison beers. Usually you kind of follow up a little bit of caramel, right, right. a little bit of sweetness, but this is just kind of um, really in your face maltiness. Mm -hmm. And more of a gluey taste than a typical Oktoberfest Marzen taste. Definitely. But it's beer. It's beer. It doesn't taste like corn like certain other beers that we've had on the show. Oh, God. I'm, I don't even want to know. <laughs> well, to be fair, for that particular beer, it was uh, the Ice Beer Challenge. The Ice Beer Challenge? Yeah. Bucket full of ice beer and... Psh. Oh, for a second, I thought you were going to say you got like a bunch of butt ice and like... No, this was uh, better. It was Frio. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't even know that was a thing until I went through an H-E-B once and realize like man standards are just getting mm -hmm. way lower yes yes so with that be sure to like comment and subscribe and if you're watching on youtube ring the bell and if you're watching on facebook be sure to share with all your friends so until well today's tech supposed to be monday but i think today's wednesday because i'm not gonna be able to edit until wednesday so until thursday beer bros out <laughs> <laughs> it'll get better yeah <laughs>